Don't miss this next video. You can only imagine what I'm gonna make with all of this. So welcome back to the channel. Today's something I've been wanting to show you guys, the easiest way to use these wraps for the tops of your wine bottles. Um, we're getting ready to go on a cruise. I like to take some of my homemade wine with me. I just put in a regular wine bottle, empty it, fill it, cork it. And now that's my wine in there with a label. When you go on cruises, you can't take your own homemade wine. You're allowed a bottle of wine per person. Uh, so I just used another label that was already on a wine bottle and I reuse those so I'm going to show you the easiest way to do this when you buy these you can get them in all kinds of different colors uh, I just have the standard black here But these are just foil wraps and you just want to get them on here And we're going to show you how to seal these up so it looks like a professional job and if you're going to give them away as gifts it's another way uh, to, to basically finish your wine bottle so it looks professional. As a winemaker, that's what you want to strive for. You want it to look like a professional did made your wine, and you want the taste to be there as well. So watch all my videos. I show you how to make different kinds of wines, how to use equipment. This is going to be a fairly short video, but it's a, a, an important video because I'm getting ready to go on a cruise and I need to get these done. So you'll read different methods of people of how to put these on here. Uh, do you need a heat gun? Uh, will a hair dryer work? I find that you don't need that kind of equipment. I'm just going to give you the easy way. Uh, no heat gun needed. No hair dryer needed. Uh, they, they, number one, the heat, heat gun will get so hot and will be difficult to work with. And a hair dryer is just not hot enough, in my opinion. But this is the fail safe way. Let's get into it and show you the easiest way to do this with no equipment needed. So the first step is to get yourself uh, a pan of water that's kind of deep enough that you can stick your bottleneck of your wine down in. So we're going to get this water boiling and we'll show you the next step. So of course what you need is you need your wine bottles that have already been filled with your homemade wine and corked and you'll need your uh, shrink capsules. They come in all kinds of lengths, colors. All right, you can see here we got the water boiling. Now, hopefully the camera's not gonna be in my way for me to try this, but uh, we're basically ready to, to wrap these wine bottles. So let's get started. What you wanna do is we'll take this lid off. I'm gonna just shut, the, shut off the heat because this will be hot enough for these two bottles that I'm gonna do for our cruise. So you take the wine bottle and you just kind of hold it on you know place it down over obviously and you kind of just want to hold it on there with your finger we're going to dip it and then we're just going to swirl it around and there you go you can see it's a perfect wrap we're going to do another one hold the finger down dip it in Sit in there for a second and just rotate it under the water. About three to five seconds should do it. And you can see, perfect seal. Cruise ship will never know. So you can see, we just took it off the heat. Uh, you can look down here at the bottom. It's perfectly sealed around, uh, melted on there. And you can see that the cap on top looks great. So here's the other one. You can see it's just the, the easiest way is this boiling water method. You don't need any heat guns, no hair dryers. This will work perfectly. So we got these done. I'm ready for the cruise. Make sure you check out my other channel along for the journey. I'll put the link in the description, but we do travel videos. These will be on that video. You'll get to see it please subscribe to that other channel as well. Subscribe here if you're not. I hope I gave you some good information. There's a lot more coming down the line on this channel. Hope to see you soon. Happy New Year. 
and enjoy hopefully a prosperous new year for all of us I need a little sunshine oh, it's been a hard year I had a lot of dark nights and we're still waiting on some daylight to reappear and